हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल आई एम अरमुगान एंड यू आर वाचिंग निंजा इराकी दिनार यूट्यूब चैनल होपफुली यू ऑल डूइंग वेल गॉड विल गिव यू मोर हैप्पीनेस फॉर यू ऑल आई ट्राई माय लेवल बेस्ट टू गिव यू ऑल लेटेस्ट अपडेट अबाउट इराकी दिनार सो गाइस लेट्स स्टार्ट टुडे द इंफॉर्मेशन When discussing the expansion of operations, it's argued that the preference is shifting towards maintaining a fixed official exchange rate rather than allowing the currency to float freely. While the floating of the IQD would eventually align it with the real effective exchange rate, it's believed that it will be stabilized or capped. In my opinion, an exchange rate of 1.32 is still insufficient because the parallel market is virtually non-existent. A rate of 76 cents does not adequately address the situation. Meanwhile, the US dollar has appreciated by 4.31% against the Vietnamese dong since the beginning of 2024. Despite this, Vietnam is targeting significant GDP growth of 6.5 to 7% in the third quarter and aims to keep inflation below 4.5%. This is a remarkable achievement, especially in light of the current global economic challenges. What does this mean for the rest of the world? This growth is not only significant for Vietnam but also has implications for other global economies including the United States. The pressure on Vietnam to raise its exchange rate stems from its strong economic performance, which attracts foreign investment and trade. By understanding Vietnam's economic goals and achievements, we can gain valuable insights into the global economic landscape and potential opportunities for growth. As we continue to monitor Vietnam's progress in achieving its GDP growth target and maintaining low inflation rates, it is crucial to recognize the impact it has on the broader economic context. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like, share and comment on this video.